What's good, guys? This is Shamor. You're back with Kicking It With Moral. All right, today we're going to be doing a video on my sockets purchase. I purchased the Air Max 90 infrared, infrared, <laughs> infrareds. <laughs> and uh, I want to say it was not a good purchase for me. Um, this is my first purchase from StockX because um, I heard a lot about it. And a lot of my friends have purchased from StockX. Um, I normally, personally, prefer goats over StockX because um, I have not had any, you know, I have not had any complaints with goats uh, so far. I have not. Um, everything I purchased from goat, which was the LeBron James and the Air Max 97 Wild West, uh, I haven't had any complaints with it. All right. So, um, but to, for some reason, I decided to purchase from Stockies just to see, you know, their quality uh, for their shoes and their authentication process and all of that. Now, um, let me grab this. I, I can say that I, when I purchased from Stockies, they gave me all of this stuff um, to go in the shoe box with their thank you card, their StockX um, sticker they gave me. What's me about StockX is that you would authenticate the shoe um, but not find anything wrong with defects. Like on um, how the shoe looks, you wouldn't find anything wrong with it. That's what bothered me about StockX. Now, I purchased, I purchased these infrared 90s on StockX. Um, everything was checked out, everything checked out. But just one little problem. It had this blue tint all around my mesh going around the shoe blue tint you know tie-dye transfer it looked it, it looked just like that man so i'm looking and you can see the blue right there right there so i'm looking at the shoe and i'm just like what in the hell <laughs> like what the hell is going on how would you be able to authenticate this shoe but still see this blue on this mesh and not and still give it to your you know consumer and that's what bothers me about StockX right now. I, I did not have a good first time purchase from them. Um, and in a minute, I'm going to show you what I mean about the mesh and stuff like that. I did not find that this was a good purchase for me. Um, hand working with StockX and actually buying something from them. Uh, for now, on, I'm going to be completely buying from GOAT. Um, if not go nike.com foot locker all those retailers like that i will continue buying from them but stockets they kind of turn me off <laughs> from purchasing anything else from them now they have been more than cooperative um with me um either they say they i can either request a refund which i did or uh twenty dollars off my next purchase which, no, <laughs> I, I don't want a $20 on my next purchase because I don't want to purchase anything else for StockX. Um, but like I said, um, <clears throat> it's a dope shoe and I really, really wanted the shoe so badly. I bought this at the end of December and was supposed to get this Friday, but instead I got it Monday and that was another thing. Uh, Go is good with authenticating shoes, but they're also good with getting your shoes here on time. And that's another thing with Sockets. It took me, it took me almost forever just to get this shirt, get this shoe. Um, I think I purchased it on the 20th. I think it was the 20th of December and got it January today, like <laughs> uh, the 11th. So, uh, yeah, that's another thing. So, um, yeah, but like I said, I'm going to repurchase this shoe off a of goat. Um, <clears throat> if you guys know a place I can purchase them, you know, other than goat, then, you know, by all means, comment down below and let me know. Um, but I think I'm going to go on goat and get another pair of these, and I will do a review on them so you guys can see um, and give you my opinion on the shoe. Um, but, yeah, like I said, I will not be purchasing for sockets. If you guys want to purchase from Sockets, uh, purchase at your own risk. Um, but this is my opinion personally. I will not be purchasing any, any more shoes off of Sockets, period. Um, but yeah, that's my review, you guys. And I'm going to show you guys the tint that's on this white part right here. It's like a dye transfer. I'm just like, this is, it, that was ridiculous. Because <laughs> I was just so happy to get my shoes today. And 
it turned out to be depressing. Please like my video, comment down below if you had any problems with stockings, um, and subscribe to the video. How that blue just doesn't mesh well with that white. And you can see the blue little ink spots right there. But to the untrained eye, you could you wouldn't be able to tell, but I can tell. And that's what I don't like. There is some blue right there at the top of the toe box right here on the mesh part. Um, you can tell it's kind of blue tintish because you got the white tongue and the white laces that you can actually see the color changing when it hits to the mesh on the toe. Then you have it going around the back of the mesh on the shoe as well.